another video. Today I'm reviewing the mini wooden easel for Walmart. I'm sure some of you guys have seen this. So I got this back in 2015, I think either February or January, I can't remember. Um, I saw this and I thought it was cool so I got it. So let's open it. I opened it already as you can tell. But I haven't used it. I haven't painted with it. I just... I wasn't expecting it to be like this small. This little small thing. I thought it was going to be like like a little bigger. You know, bigger than this size. I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger like this. And it could hold canvases up to this size. But it can't. Like, it can't hold it this side because if you put it on a, the canvas tray like this, it's too big. So you have to turn it landscape. You can't paint portrait, but you have to turn it landscape in order to paint. So, I guess it's beneficial to some of you guys out there that paint, you know, landscape. But I like to paint portraits. So, all of, mostly all of my paintings is portraits. So, and this is how you use the, the uh, mini easel. So, you unscrew these things. From the sides in order to put it the tray down I me mean the um the canvas not the canvas but the the easel down <laughs> just unscrew it and it comes out like this so for some of you that doesn't know how to use an easel i'm sure you know you you've seen how to use an easel before before you went and buy the easel they even come with instructions so they even come with instructions in the box to show you how to use it this this right here i didn't really it's pictures so i really i mean i got the i know how to use it when i bought the easel i know how to use the easel when i bought it but maybe some of you guys out there don't you know exactly know can follow instructions oh it got words on it but it shows you right here the instructions on how to use the easel and it has the words but I never noticed the instructions. So, so this part you can let up and down. See, it just it just went down. It goes all the way down like that. So you can hold different sizes. It can hold us up to canvases up to twelve inches. So this is far. Like I can put it all the way up here, and it's still like it still won't hold my canvas because obviously my canvas is not. Let me see quick where y'all can see. My canvas, this canvas board is not, is over 12 inches, so it would not fit in the little holder thing. It would not fit there. But like I said, I mean, it's good for small projects, so if you like to paint small, you start out, it's good, like a beginner, it's good to start with this. It's sturdy. It's something that we gotta tighten this part for it to, to stay up, but. It's sturdy. It's very sturdy. It's not going to break when you drop it. Um, let's compare the size to my big easel here. See, so so y'all guys can see how small it is. And it's definitely for a table. Like, if you're just sitting, like, hold on, let me, let me give you guys an example. So, if you're just sitting, imagine this is a table. And it's tall, the table is taller than you. Like, the table is, like, right here. So, you just sitting here. You're just painting, you know, so for some of those who like to paint closely, I like to paint close. Like I like to get close up to my paintings. But um, so you just said it's very good for that for a table. So you can get really close details and everything. But let's compare um easels. So I can show you guys how small it is. Oh, so here's the floor. And here's the small canvas. I mean, the small. I keep saying canvas. The small easel compared to the huge easel. That's how small it is. So I so, definitely recommend this easel to people that starting out, beginners, artists, um, people that paint small, college students. As a gift, you could get somebody a gift. You could get this easel. It's for Walmart, so you can get it. You can definitely get it for them for a present. Um, yeah, so I'm definitely going to use this easel in, in the near future for something. I'm not sure of what yet. Um, 
so yeah, I'm going to end this video. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next video.